Hello everyone, um, this is Tomb Raider Crony and this is another um, Tomb Raider level editor um, game I'm playing. Um, it was released in the beginning of December and it is a really um, great adventure. It consists of um, three levels, there are 13 secrets. I'm going to um, try to find them all. So cast off. And we... We are stranded on an island right now with nice um, um, tropical plants and stuff. And this um, island is actually huge. And yeah, um, see the water um, fading off in the distance. It's a really nice effect, but you can't um, actually um, swim there. Some currents um, stop you from doing that. And there are some um, health items hidden in here. They're very well placed. Um, I think, um, if I remember right, the um, big medipack is the pineapple, and the small medipack is papaya. And let's go first swim at the waterfall. I think there's a passage here. Yeah. My game is a bit is um, lagging a bit in the uh, on the seashore. And also, there's another area where it uh, where it goes l really slow in the um, village. Uh, my PC says I'm not strong enough. All right, there are some red um, crosses on the trees, and yeah, if you um, use it, well, um, push the tree, the coconut falls on Lara's head. So we got a half a, a coconut, and this one hides a treasure. And these treasures are secrets. I think this was the first one. Yep, there are thirteen secrets altogether in this game. I found all of them, so let's hope I won't miss any of them in this playthrough. And yeah, Laura, you should pay more attention to to the signs. Don't. Shake the trees, or you might hit your head. Okay, you can um, shake the other trees as well, but um, they don't contain anything. Only those two. And oh my God, do you see what I see? It really upsets me. Let, let's see. Do you see that? Why is the rum gone? Well, let's ask that lady if she knows anything about that. Oh, a visitor. You don't look like a pirate. What do you want here? The current brought me here. Where are we? Mm-hmm. Nice island to strand on. This is Puerto Corona. Puerto Corona? A cute monkey's there. Oh, the island where the last pirate prince buried his crown, if you believe the legend. Yep, right. And whoever finds it will be prince or princess. But listen, bring me some rum. Maybe then I'll tell you some more. The store is right here around the corner, but the entrance caved in. Take a look in the hut up there. Maybe you'll find something useful. Or look around. Oh, thanks, mysterious pirate lady. So we'll need some rum. For for her to drink, do you want to drink all that? Well, the monkeys in this game aren't harmful for Lara. And, yeah, they even have a nice uh, pirate hat. It's a nice touch. I also love those um, bottles with fire on the trees. All right. So, remembering what she said, we should go up there. It might look like that. It's not possible, but it is. You have to um, position Laura carefully, and she should be able to um, grab the ladder. What? What is that? A rope? Oh, come on, Laura, please! It's not so easy when my game is lagging. It's even slower because I'm recording. It's on 7 FPS right now. 
Mists of Avalon, Mists of Avalon is even worse uh, in terms of lagging. Sometimes it went down to 4 FPS while playing. Oops, I can't see anything. Alright. Here we go. Here's a chest. And it hides something, it seems. And we found a... Uh, what, what is it? A peg leg. Alright, and now we have a, an improvised shovel. No. And let's try to use this. Okay. And right now, uh, we'll go back to the beginning to get a secret. Because um, there's a red cross, a red axe, at, at one of the trees. Yeah, here it is. And you can use the shovel here if you face um, the water. In other directions it's not really working, but if you face um, this direction, you can use this. And it's easier to pick up the item if you um, crawl. Whoops. Some fire sprites appearing on the screen. <laughs> Sometimes it happens in my levels too. Alright, and now we have to um, go to the other side of the island and we should know that there are two um, closed doors on the other side. I haven't taken a look, but there's one with a lock and another one with a keyhole. And here you, we can use the um, shovel. Yeah, like Amanda sa said, whoops, what do the arche archaeologists do? The, yeah, dig. Alright, and we. Nice call. Oh! Ew! Laura's boots, alright. And Laura's. We can see inside her. It's um, advisable to save here. Because if you go further. Well, you, you'll see. Let's see what happens. Oops! Oh no! Epic fail! I love that <laughs> riding there. Oh yeah, um. I guess it will take a while, uh, while uh, until I can. <gasps> Oops! No, 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 no! I didn't want to ah uh, activate it so early. Um, right. What should I do? Took me a while until I realized that. Oops! Yeah, I have to. Oh no! Laura got stuck there. I jumped on the wrong place. So um, yeah. To avoid this, you have to um, use the slopes and jump sideways. It's a bit hard because um, the space here is a bit narrow. Alright. Let's avoid these objects here. And let's go further and see what, what this place hides. Yeah, some si spiders. Let's shoot them. Green spiders. <laughs> Alright. Oops, what was that? Oh, uh, a lot of rum here. <laughs> Hope you won't go alcoholic, Laura. Let's not steal the ladies' rum. Yeah, uh, this is a uh, bottle for non alcoholics. <laughs> Empty. I haven't seen that um, text before. I haven't taken a look. No, this is a bit tricky because if you go in here, these barrels start to roll. You have to be quick to avoid them. It's kind of like in Tomb Raider 2, the Great Wall <laughs> reminds me of that. All right, uh, more spiders. These are some transparent green spiders. Oh, that that one got a bit distracted by that wall. What's so interesting there? Okay, yeah, here's some um, flying things that uh, suggest that you can use this bottle here. So it is a hint. And now the bottle is filled with um, water. Water? Uh, definitely not water. 
with something sp stronger. Now we have rum. So, let's go back to the lady. Oops. And yeah, the bears um, are stopped for now. And that was actually a nice idea to stop them because I wouldn't really want to run through that again. And let's save. And yeah, here's this um, rope leather leather which we can use to get up. And now uh, let's bring back the ram to the to the lady in order to get directions. Oh oh oh! No, this was wasn't a good idea. I should have done something else because yeah, I think I I have to sh uh, shimmy to the right slightly, slightly, um, in order to um. Avoid this, um, these stones, rocks. <laughs> English is on holidays again. Oh no, please, Laura. Behave. Let don't let some rocks stop you. All right. I'll climb on the more than one on the middle because if you climb on the on the sides, Laura will climb really um, slowly. Okay. Let's see what I can do here. Yeah, this that um, did the trick. All right, now let's go back. No, I don't want to bring them, bring it for her. I want to drink it all. Ah, you're better than I thought. Don't hold it against me. Just wanted to see what you can do. I've never seen so much rum. <laughs> Most of that is empty. Oh, here. This will open the door to the bayou in the middle of the island. What is beyond the other door? There's an old lair that still gets used every now and then. Right now, it's empty. I'm gonna go back there now. You'll find me in the tavern. Uh -huh. See you. Mm, everything is empty, just like your rum bottles. What's going on here? <laughs> She's drinking it all? Is she drinking it all? I hope not. Alright. I don't think I have the key for this place yet. We got a key from... from yeah, this is a bio key not sure how how it's spelled well spelled um pronounced i always mix those um words up yeah, it's usable in here and now let's go and i'll save yeah this is a beautiful area and all we have to do here is um grabbing the rope and getting to the other side. Alright. Hope I can position Laura carefully. Whoops, I didn't want to shoot. But that but I made it now. Yeah, um with a careful jump you can jump here. And oops. Alright. I made it. Okay, here's a switch that opened the trap door as far as I can hear. There's no passage here, okay. And let's do a swan dive because we like that. Alright, path um, got um, opened here. So let's do some swimming down here. And I hope I won't. Um, run out of air. There's a secret hi hidden somewhere here. But I don't really remember the path. Oh, Laura, don't get stuck, please. Oops. Uh, I'll go the other way because um, on that other passage, on the opposite side, there's a secret. But I'll go for go to ah, come on. I'll go to get some air first. All right, here we go. And I'll save. And let's go back for the secret. 
hoping I'll uh, remember the path. Oops. Yeah, here it is, I think. In this place. Just before the um, chest. Treasure chest. Yeah, so I have three um, secrets now. Alright. Um, swimming underwater is pretty much uh, yeah, very. Uh, it can be tricky sometimes because where can get stuck in narrow spaces. Whoops. Oh, well, that, that was. Uh, I wanted to say that was pure luck, but. Yeah, I. Unintentionally. Oh, well, I, I won't care now. I just ran through. Unintentionally walked, walked uh, in the way of the, uh, of the darts. And this is now the next level. Bio. Um, if, if that's how it's um, pronounced. Hey, let's go for another swim. This level is absolutely beautiful. This place. It's full of underwater animals and plants and yeah the environment is absolutely stunning I love it and in also the scenery on the, on the land and the, yeah there's a waterfall a couple of trees around and beautiful rocks um, let's see what we can do here there are two switches on the water switches I think and uh, yeah, that was one. There is another one on the opposite side. Okay. All right. And here we go. The the door has been opened, and we swim into the next huge area. Ooh, all right. And I'll go out of the water now and look around because this is an absolutely stunning area. It must be one of the most beautiful um, places in custom levels. It's really, really nice and very well and detailed underwater with a lot of fish and underwater ve vegetation. It's really beautiful. Okay, now I think I'll go get the the other secrets now because oh oh not well I'll go for it re later because um, there's a secret on the on the rocks over there I hope I won't forget it all right there should be a passage yeah I can see a passage there and that's yet another secret so let's go get that one. Didn't get stuck so far. Yay, SpongeBob SquarePants! I don't don't watch the cartoon, but um, someone I know loves it. <laughs> well, two people I know, a lot of people. It's a really really nice Easter egg. It's funny. And there are a couple of these in secrets, and it makes it uh, finding um, the treasures uh, really interesting. Alright, let's go get some air before I uh, drown. What is that? It looks. Oh, that thing looked really strange down there. But now it's not here. Oh well. I'm not sure what that was. Maybe I'm just imagining things. Yeah, yay! Nice fishes. Right. And now there are some pa more passages in here. And up there, where I didn't grab the ledge, um, there's a passage. But if you go there, some spikes will, um, unfortunately, well, um, some spikes will um, immediately kill you. So I'll go down here first and collect um, something that will 
prevent um, the spikes from killing Laura. Where do I go? It's a bit confusing. But yay! All right, there's some air. Oh, and a couple of um. I'm not sure what these are called in English. Whoops. But these are. These hurt Lara. Because they, they are spiky. Okay. Um. And in this area, I got pretty much confused when I was playing for the first time and I wasn't the only one. Because, um. Um. It's not. Uh, you can't really find anything over here except these crabs and nearly all of them are moving but this one is not so yeah let's gra grab a crab <laughs> as we can use this one to um, disable the spikes just like um, the mechanism in Tomb Raider 4 in Cleopatra's palaces, I think. There's a small scarab. Oops, mechanism. If you put the pieces together, it moves through the path of the spikes, and it ac activates them one by one. And um, it won't be activated by Lara if you go through there anymore. And in this level, um, this crab is what deactivates them. Let's go up here. Here we go. And yeah, uh, now the um, flyby video sequence shows us a monkey. And we will have to release that monkey because Laura can't reach um, the uh, the switch up there. So, a monkey is a bit more talented in climbing than Laura, and it will activate the switch for us. Oh, yeah. Let's use the crabby. Alright, and now I can pick it up. Or oh, can't. I thought we could. Okay. Now let's go through the path. And yeah, the monkey got released now. It's not harmful to Laura, if I remember right, but you shouldn't shoot it. The monkey, if if it, if it would go on the right place, it will... Yeah, it climbs up and uses the switch. And sometimes there is a, a weird thing happening that the monkey won't um, climb up and it's ju it is just um, um, going against the wall and in those cases um, when I reloaded ga the game and um, I was positioning Laura in, in different um, well, I was uh, going in different pa places with Laura it got solved oh I, I read I, I hope I'm right I read um, that um, it's possible to uh, shoot the monkey and it will um, it will be reborn <laughs> and it will go up and use the switch. So if you have problems with the monkey you can do these. And let's swim again back to the other side because the door got opened somewhere. We'll have to do a puzzle if I remember right. And let's climb up at this anchor. Alright. Now I'm um, um, at the secret place in a way. So I hope I can jump over there and get it. We. Oops. No. Not we. It's a bit tricky. Because you have to. Oh! Um, you have to um, land on the um, on the flat surface place. Ok, 
Okay. How did I do that previously? Yeah, this way. There's a small um, slope on the rocks there. And if you, you go here, you can find a secret. Look, <laughs> a surf thingy with the with the builder's name. It's also a nice, um, well, kind of an Easter egg. All right. Now I'll save again because these rocks are slippery. Well, let's go here. And here's some um, block pushing and pulling puzzle. Um, the main objective is that the um, skulls should look um, in the dire direction of the center. So you have to um, push and pull these um, according to that. So let's do that. They are pretty much scary a little bit <laughs> for me at least they look like the um, load and save items in the inventory this one goes on the other place because it looks in a, in a different direction and that one should look should go there this is the last ah. one There's a longer um, pushing and pulling puzzle with um, some crates later on. And this one, oops, oh, it scared me a little bit. Alright, let's see what we can find here. Oh, no, is stealing stuff again. Okay, we got a medal, I think, an amulet. And the, we got the layer key. So now we can go to the layer. And let's do that. I think um, we don't have to um, return into this beautiful level again, unfortunately. I can see why it, uh, why it had to be um, a separate level. Where is the passage outside? Well, not outside, but backwards. Here it is. Bye bye fish. I don't want to leave this beautiful place. And when I was playing this for the first time, I've st I've spent a nice amount of um, time with um, admiring the underwater life in the level. It's really really <laughs> interesting everywhere. And it's actually uh, realistic. I've seen some fishes that fish like um, these in real life. They look um, very similar to the um, real ones. All right. Oh, not this passage again. <laughs> Or is it me being crap at swimming on the water? It might be. Okay. Oops, a bit of bit of a uh, lagging again. Alright. And now we are back on the seashore. And it's possible to open the doors here. Because we have the have the layer key. Alright, I'll save here. And this is the place where I'm going to stop for now. Because um, there's a longer and more complex area coming up. And I think I, I'll um, do that all together. If I can do that in a shorter time. So... Uh, the video size uh, I record won't be that long. See you then in that episode. And let's swim to the title and chill out. Bye everyone!